Hey guys, just wanted to share with you our new special blend here this week at Cleveland's. It's made by our friends down at Little Marionette and it's called the Sanchez Number no. 7. Hey guys, it's Rosemary here. I finally made it to the Cherry Blossom Festival that I told you about. And if you look behind me, it is absolutely incredible. The season only lasts for one more week, so make sure that you get down here. And if you post pictures, tag me so that I can see. The driver says skip and the wingman wants to listen to the song. There's three times that he can say, no, I'm not skipping this song. I think that's really reasonable. They're great rules. It's warm is. and sunny. It's not. It's actually quite windy. Yeah, it's a little bit chilly. But, but we wish you were here. Exactly, we do. And uh, we'll see you soon. Very soon. Bye. Bye. Mel, tell us about Daybreaker and what's going on behind you. Totally. Good morning. It's Mel. We're here at Daybreaker Chicago. I'm the Chicago producer of these crazy morning dance parties with yoga. We throw them all across the world. Here we're in Chicago doing a silent disco. It started at 5.30 in the morning with yoga. At 6.30 we switched it up to this crazy dance party. Everyone rocking out, having fun. If you want to dance, if you want to avoid the club scene, if you want to avoid the velvet ropes and exclusion, start your morning off with a dance party at Daybreaker. Hey guys, Justin here with Movo. We're going to be taking a look at the VXR10 Universal Cardioid Microphone from Movo. We'll check out all the devices that we can use it with, we'll also check out what comes inside the box, and we'll even get a sample of what the mic actually sounds like. Here on the front of the box it shows us what types of devices the microphone is compatible with. On the back we can learn about more of the features and specifications of the microphone as well. First up, the manual. This goes into a lot more detail on the specifications and features of the microphone. It also lets us know different ways to use the microphone, which we're going to check out here in just a minute. We have the happy, not happy comment card. Let you know how to reach out to Movo if you have any questions or comments. And here we have the two connectors, which will allow us to hook the microphone up to a variety of different devices. First is the 3.5 millimeter TRRS connector. This will allow you to hook up the microphone to a smartphone, tablet, or a Mac. And next up we have the 3.5 millimeter TRS connector, which you can use to connect to DSLR cameras, camcorders, um, audio recorders, and other audio video recording devices. And here we have the VXR microphone itself, which comes with the furry windscreen already attached. If you want to take that off, just gently pull the microphone out of there and it'll come right out. You can use it with or without the windscreen and that all depends on what you're going to be recording and where. Right here on the bottom of the microphone is that 3.5 millimeter jack. That's where you're going to plug in one of those connectors, depending on the type of device that you'll be using the microphone with. 
Next up, we have the shock mount. This is what you're gonna to use to connect your microphone either to your DSLR camera or to some other type of mount. Here on the bottom, it's easy to see that this can be attached to any standard tripod or a cold or hot shoe mount, just depending on what you wanna hook it up to. And last but not least, we have a nice bag that comes with the microphone. This is what you can use to keep it safe and secure when the microphone's not being used. And here are some of the devices that you can use the VXR10 with. I'm gonna be using it with my smartphone here that I have hooked up to Movo's PR1 mount, which makes it easy to connect right on the top. Since I'm gonna be using the microphone with my smartphone, I need to pull out that 3.5 millimeter TRRS connector. I'm simply gonna take the microphone end of that connector, plug it into the VXR10, make sure it snaps in all the way. Now I wanna connect this to my mount. The mount that I'm using, like I said, is the PR1. It's a smart grip that's intended to use with smartphones. Check out a video on that if you're curious to learn a little bit more. Take the microphone that's on the shock mount and slide it into the cold shoe adapter tighten it down and make sure it's tightened all the way because I don't want the mic to go anywhere and then you should be good to go. The only thing left to do now, plug in that microphone and hit record. We're all set up, let's go ahead and see how it sounds. You're now listening to me through the VXR10 Universal Cardioid Microphone. I have it plugged into my HTC10 and atop the PR1 Smart Grip from Movo. We'll compare the VXR10 microphone to the onboard microphone on my HTC10, and then we'll back it up and see what the difference is like on both microphones at a little bit more distance. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? And there you have it, the VXR10 Universal Cardioid Microphone from Movo. I hope that this video gave you a little bit more insight on how you can use the microphone with different devices that you may have. As always, if you have any questions or comments, please don't hesitate to reach out to us. We love hearing from you guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. This is the iPhone 4 without the microphone, and I'm gonna walk back to five feet, 10 feet, 15 feet, and we're gonna go down the 20 feet this way. You can see the actual difference between the, with the microphone or without the microphone. And we're gonna add the microphone now to your, the iPhone 4. We're gonna plug it in. And now the iPhone 4 is plugged in. And you can all hear me clearly with the new eye microphone. And uh, this is at 15 feet, 10 feet, 5 feet. If you own a GoPro Hero camera, you may have already noticed that it does not have a normal microphone input jack or headphone jack like many other devices. You can buy an expensive mic input cable, but then you need to buy a mic, and you still don't have any way to connect your headphones. Wouldn't it be great if there was an adapter that would allow you to plug in your headphones and record using an external microphone? Or connect a high-quality microphone and listen with your headphones while you record? Well, now you can. Imagine how much better your videos will come out when you can add narration while recording that great video. It's as simple as plugging in the adapter and then connecting a set of headphones with the microphone attached. Then you can add narration and listen while you are recording. Or if you are looking to record a subject and want to get the best sound, then we offer a shotgun microphone. The microphone has a hypercardioid pattern to pick up only the subject and less of the unwanted background sounds. Plus, you can also listen through the headphone jack on the back. So if you are looking to get the best sound with your GoPro Hero camera, then finally, there is a way to give you the sound you need. Hey folks, Justin here with Movo. We're going to be taking a look at the LV-1 lavalier microphone from Movo. This is a universally compatible lavalier microphone, which essentially means you're going to be able to use this with smartphones, most DSLRs, camcorders, audio recorders, uh, other devices that use that 3.5 millimeter jack. Let's go ahead and take a look inside the box. 
First up here, we have our happy, not happy comment card. Let's us know how to reach out to Movo if we have any questions or comments. Uh, we also have the manual, which is gonna have an overview of the microphone, polar patterns, how to set up and use the microphone, all kinds of good stuff. Be sure to check this out. Next, let's check out the accessories. This does come included with a battery for the microphone, as well as a mic clip. This is great for clipping onto a lapel or anywhere else on your clothing. Also a foam windscreen for the microphone. There's also a quarter inch plug adapter, which is awesome if you have audio devices that you're recording into that require this. And also this adapter here, which is great for being able to not only plug in your mic, but also monitor on headphones at the same time um, with that single port. And finally, the microphone. As you can see, there's a decent amount of cable here. There's actually 20 feet, which is gonna be fantastic for most uh, situations. The microphone itself is an omnidirectional condenser microphone, uh, meaning it's gonna pick up in all directions. So you're not gonna have to worry too much about the direction that it's clipped on your subject. Um, it's gonna pick up in all directions. This right here is a power pack where you're actually gonna install the battery for the microphone. Um, there's also a switch here that will allow you to switch between camera and smartphone settings. So depending on what you're using to record your audio, just make sure that that switch is flipped appropriately. Let's go ahead and slip this windscreen on real quick. It'll slide right over the top. Um, next, we'll take that clip that just clamps right on there and we're ready to go. All right, I'm all mic'd up and we're just about ready to flip on the LV-1 and start recording, test out that audio. Um, you may have already noticed a change in the audio. That's because I switched from the shotgun microphone that was plugged into my camera to the onboard microphone. Um, we will be comparing the audio from my onboard microphone from the Canon XF400 with the LV-1 lavalier microphone from Movo. Um, I'm going to go ahead and switch it to on here on the little power pack and record the audio on my Zoom H5 handy recorder. We are all plugged in and ready to go. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? And there you have it, the LV-1 lavalier microphone from Movo. I hope this video provided you with some more information about the microphone and how you can use it. If you have any questions or comments, please don't hesitate to reach out and let us know. We love hearing from you guys here at Movo. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Hi guys, Ryan here from Rode, and I'm excited to show you the new Rode SmartLav Plus. Now when we first introduced the SmartLav, it was insanely popular and we've been very happy with its progress so far, but we've had a lot of requests for an even higher quality model than the SmartLav so that you can get really true broadcast quality audio directly onto an iOS device or an Android device depending on the application that you're using. Now what we've done with the SmartLav Plus is we've actually installed a higher quality capsule than the original SmartLav. So what that means is that it's got far more detail in the actual frequency pickup and it's also got a lower noise floor. So you can now get really nice sounding recordings with much less effort with the SmartLav Plus. Lately we've released a bunch of new accessories that have the TRRS connector. So we recognize the need to have some kind of way to differentiate the different connectors that you have in your camera bag at first glance. So with our new devices that have the TRRS connector, you'll notice that they have a grey sleeve. The grey sleeve will be featured on all of our connectors that are designed to work directly with mobile devices and tablets. So there you have it, the SmartLav Plus with a broadcast quality capsule with the convenience of being able to connect it directly to your mobile device.